Welcome to the Bad Elf training series on achieving high accuracy with the GNSS Surveyor. Before we begin, it's important to understand proper receiver orientation. A Bad Elf GPS receiver performs best when the LCD is facing towards the sky, there are minimal obstructions around, and there are no metal objects above the receiver. Within 30 to 45 seconds, your Bad Elf receiver will acquire a GPS lock and begin navigating. It will take at least another four and a half minutes before SBAS corrections are received. During this time, accuracy is generally three meters or better. At four and a half to five minutes, the Bad Elf GNSS surveyor will lock onto SBAS and positional accuracy will improve even further. The Bad Elf iOS app will show the SBAS satellites on the right portion of the bar graph. At six and a half to seven minutes, the GNSS surveyor will achieve a PPV result that is submeter. It is best to leave the GNSS surveyor over the point you are trying to capture for at least 30 seconds. And finally, if you need to move the surveyor, try to keep it horizontal and unobstructed as it is being moved. 